A Northwestern University freshman is recovering after getting shot off campus last night in Rogers Park. The university just sent a letter to students offering mental health services to help students as they prepare for finals. CBS 2 Sabrina Franza has the latest on the investigation. It was like, you know, really loud. Boom, 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 boom. It was like, like it was in my house. Robbie Staggers heard the shots, saw nothing. Oh my God, it was so many. I, didn't, I, don't, I still don't remember how many. That was around 1015 on a Monday night. A Northwestern freshman shot three times. Police counted about 40 shell casings. At least 10 shots were heard and a shooter ran left down the alley. He has no description. The student was with a witness. When they heard the shots, both of them ran. It wasn't until they took cover in a nearby doorway that they realized she was injured. That witness drove her to St. Francis Hospital. She was critical, now stable. Hours later, police called back to the scene, this time across the street from where they originally began their investigation, to a parking lot. That's where we met Sargo Ortiz. Somebody shooting my car, sees them in the glasses. He showed up to pick up his landscaping and concrete truck for work. In the morning I come, and uh, when I see, I, I think maybe somebody broke in the glass. He's only tried to steal something in my truck. But now when I see the, the big glass, I, I see the, the, somebody shooting. Now he has to pay out of pocket to fix it. I think the cost is around to 800 and I'm losing my day work. Glass on the ground, more evidence markers, an ongoing investigation. Police don't know a motive. Northwestern believes the student was not targeted. In the chaos of it all, that witness was not able to see the suspect. Couldn't give police a description. There are no arrests at this time. We're in Rogers Park. Sabrina Franza, CBS 2 News.